I am Martina Muscat. I am reading for a doctorate of pharmacy with the University of Malta in collaboration with the University of Illinois, Chicago. I am Roberta Jones. I am reading a doctorate of pharmacy degree with the University of Malta in collaboration with the University of Illinois, Chicago. I received an email from the Pharmacy Council um, with an expression of interest uh, by the Medicines Authority and I applied. I applied through an expression of interest published on the Medicines Authority website. After which there was an interview with the Medicines Authority and we got accepted to do this traineeship program. Um, so the advantage of this PharmD program is that it is a European program but also in collaboration with, uh, with uh, an American program, University of Illinois. So we can get comparative studies, a comparative approach towards health systems um, both based in Europe and in the USA. So the class is diverse and there are overseas students participating in this program coming from Germany, from Spain, so we can all share our experiences and learn from each other. The University of Malta is one of the oldest universities established in Europe. Um, it is set in the capital city of Malta, which incorporates with it all many of the historical um, sites taking us back to the times of the nights, which the Department of Pharmacy is part of the Faculty of Medicine and Surgery in Malta, which is one of the most established faculties. I'm currently following a traineeship program with the Medicines Authority. So the Medicines Authority is the local independent authority um, which regulates pharmaceutical activities and medicinal products with the aim of ensuring uh, the safety of public health. Um, it collaborates with European agencies such as the European Medicines Agency and it consists of doctors, pharmacists, healthcare professionals and the management team who collaborate together and work together to protect public health. I have been assigned with the office of the chairperson um, which involves taking part in the quality management system and also the medicines intelligence and access unit. So my experience at the, medicines, at the Medicines Authority has been very positive. It has helped me to increase my knowledge on the regulatory affairs related to pharmacy and also to obtain work experience in this field. It gives us the opportunity to work 20 hours, flexible, flexible hours during per week and this also gives us the opportunity to be flexible to make placements which are part of the PharmD course. We receive remuneration for the traineeship program, so it is a great opportunity since whilst conducting the Doctorate of Pharmacy program, we can also um, get exposure on the regulatory field and also get remuneration for it, which allows us to do this uh, farm farmd program to develop our skills which are we are going currently being trained in the doctorate of pharmacy program such as um, strengthening our skills in decision making communication being part of a, a great team of different healthcare professionals i have been assigned uh, at the inspectorate and enforcement directorate where I have been able to observe um, GXP inspections, including pharmacy inspections, and also a third country GMP inspection in India, which was a very fruitful experience, since I was able to see firsthand the techniques and skills required when conducting an inspection of a, far of a manufacturing facility. So, on and all, it has been a very positive experience, and it complements the PharmD program because the PharmD program mainly covers the clinical aspect of pharmacy. Um, my placement was at Caring Greg Hospital where we spent four weeks um, with the clinical pharmacist on, on the ward where we took part in uh, ward meetings with different healthcare professionals such as um, specialists, geriatrics, geriatric specialists. Um, occupational therapists, physiotherapists, which makes us um, gives, gave us the opportunity to make part of a big uh, healthcare professional team. With the traineeship program, it helps us to broaden our knowledge since it also covers the regulatory aspect of pharmacy. So I would like to thank the University of Malta and the Medicines Authority for this great opportunity and also the staff at the Medicines Authority for welcoming us. And um, I suggest uh, the strangeship program to all those who uh, are up to a new challenge in life and who wish to enhance their professional development.